This review is about this travel plug. Now travel plugs are fantastic things. This type of travel plug, well I can't be without them, I've got a few of them in the house already because I use them when I'm not traveling as well as traveling. But this one is going to serve a particular purpose which I'm going to go through with you now. So this is the iBlock Cube one. I've got another iBlock Cube one which you'll see and then I've also got a, a, a different manufacturer. Right, so let's have a look at this in a bit more depth now. So, because it's a travel adapter, you've obviously got different countries' sockets there. And if we just go through them, basically, you push, you push that and it comes out. So, if, if I'm not mistaken, that's the US one and also European. And also, when I go out to Asia as well, it's out there as well. And it clicks in, so, oops, there's a, it clicks in. So it won't push back, which is a good thing. And to release it, you've got to press this button on the side and then it pushes back in. The next one, that's your UK standard socket there. And again, it's locked in and you need to push that in to get it back. And then the third one, oh, I'm just trying to think where this one is. Anyway. It's two different ones this, so you've got your you've got your straight one like that, but if you turn it, that's your next one. So straight, like so. I think that's uh, that's the US one, isn't it, if I'm not mistaken. And then as I say, the other one is like that. And again, locked in place, and to get rid, you've got to press that and push it back. Right, it also comes with couple of additional things so you've got your case that it fits into nice and snugly because obviously it's a travel adapter so you want to be able to pop it in your case or your bag and carry it around but the other thing it comes with is a one meter USB-C to USB-C lead and it's a braided cable as well so that's uh, that's good right the most exciting thing and you shouldn't get giddy about travel adapters, but I do, especially about this one. Most exciting thing about this is, although it's got a, a quick charge socket there, it's a 35 watt box, which basically means it can do this. Right, so this, what I'm about to show you, is what I'm most like about this travel adapter. Um, I'm going to get the supplied USB-C to USB-C. I'm going to plug it into the quick charger there. You can see it. So I'll pop that in there. Right. I'm going to put it into a UK socket, as you can see on the wall. So we need to pop the UK out. Put that in. Right. Now, you've still got the use of the socket, but if I bring the camera down here, so this is a surface type device, um, a two in one and when I take this on holiday normally I've got to take a special brick to charge it with but in this instance I don't so all I'm going to do is plug the USB-C connector into the side and I find it here somewhere there we go pop that into the side and now I'm going to come down to the bottom I'll zoom in, zoom in a bit more. You can see that it's charging and it's charging off the travel adapter, which is something I've never had before. I've never had a travel adapter that's been powerful enough to do that. So not only have you got three USB um, normal uh, plugs on there, you've got your two USB-C and it will charge this this two one which is absolutely fantastic so one last look at it i'll take it out and you'll see that it'll stop charging there we go so it's stopped charging there and if we just pull this back in and i'll zoom back out again one last look at it so three standard usb ports on top two usb c ports on the side one's a quick charge one and we'll just have one last look through the adapters you've got that one which is europe and uh, asia you've got that one which is obviously uk and you've got that one which is your america and i can't remember where the other one is uh, and again to release it you've just got to press it on the side and pull it back and as i said you shouldn't get excited about travel adapters 
but I do get excited about this one. That's a big, big recommendation. And you can see that now that one plug with the fast chargers on it, etc., has been replaced by this iBlock cube one, and it looks a lot better. So a travel plug like this isn't necessarily just useful when you're out and about. It's absolutely fantastic at home as well.